Hey guys, how's it going? Ravis Master here, and today I'll be playing Would You Rather. Now, I'm sure you guys heard about this game before. Um, it's pretty much like based on your own opinion. Like, you have to choose one thing between and I don't really think I need to uh, talk about this very much because I'm sure you guys watch YouTubers like Markiplier and the guy play this. So, anyways, let's get to it. And by answering our first question, we got Would You Rather Dance Like Michael Jackson? Or sing like Freaky Freddie Mercury. Um, I don't know who Freddie Mercury is, but I've seen Michael Jackson stamps in the movies. But I'd rather have that. So let's see, what do we got? Do -do -do -do. Wow. Oh, sorry. Uh, yeah. Um, I have a feeling that vast majority will vote for him. But I don't know. Let's see, what do we got next? Would you rather only use Windows? Or use Macintosh. Macintosh? What's that? Um, I don't know what that is, but I prefer to use Windows. I'm using Windows right now, as a matter of fact. And point proven. And it goes all the way to 79. It's a pretty large number. Right. Would you rather be killed in the Saw movie or be in the Final Destination movie? Be killed in the Final Destination. I don't know what destination is. I think, I think I've heard about it before, but I'm not too sure. But I've heard about Saw, and, and I'm very certain that in Saw that people die in a pretty brutal way. And as a matter of fact, and they make a lot of stupid choices. The final destination, um, I'm not too sure. But it also depends on how you die. I'm, I'm rather, I, I don't, I'm just guessing on this one. That's fine with me. <laughs> huh. Blind luck. Would you rather live in the penthouse in this city or live in the mansion? As much as I would like to be in the city, but that being in the penthouse means you are on the very top of the building. And it says, oh, it says you also have the same amount of money in either case. Either case? Oh, well, okay. But in the penthouse is like you get to overlook the entire city. Which is beautiful. I've seen images before, but the city is always busy, and I don't want to be. And I don't want to be in that kind of environment. But living in the mansion in the country, it would be pretty cool. I mean, I live in somewhat kind of country-like. I have two and a half acres where I live now, currently. But to have a mansion on this con on a plot of land that just goes on for acres, and just be by yourself and just see all this landscape would just be beautiful. So I would rather be in the country than in the city. Wow. More people would rather be in the country. I'm impressed. Let's see. Would you rather speak everything in surround sound or have your own interest theme when you walk in the room? Actually, I, I don't want my own theme when I walk in the room. No doubt. That would be freaking awesome. Oh, God. Like freaking John Cena. Ugh, excuse me. Yeah, I'd rather have my own, like, John Cena! Do, 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 do. Yeah, that's what John Cena, that's all John Cena. <laughs> oh well. Oh no! Oh no! Calvin and Hobbes! Oh. Whether it be Calvin or Hobbes. Now, if you don't know who Calvin and Hobbes is, these are characters from an old comic book that came out back in the 80s. My parents knew about this, and it went on for almost 10 years, and it ended back in the 1990s, and this was, a kid, this was a comic about a young boy named Calvin, he's most likely in kindergarten, and he has a stuffed tiger, and he uses his imagination to bring this stuffed tiger to life, and interact with him, and he calls, a, and he calls his friend Hobbes. And I have some of the comic book collection. I have the book collections of the strips, and it's really cool, and just thinking about it brings so many memories. I remember when I first read it, and I thought it was funny, and it still is funny. I read it every chance I get, and I actually have it on my bucket list to have anything, uh, all the comic, all the Cal and the Hobbs comic book collections. So, but I'll get back to that later. But this one's interesting. It would, be, it would cool to be hot, so because I will be able to stay home all day and be able to chill. And once Calvin comes in, I can just pounce on him, and I will have more physical advantages against Calvin. But Hobbes 
would not exist without Calvin. And Calvin is just a scrumptious little kid, and he screws up a lot. But still, he Hobbes could not exist without Calvin. And it's kind of sad to kind of think about it. And there's just like these little comic remakes people made of what was reality if Hobbes did not speak whatsoever. And it's kind of sad. But Calvin creates these things with his mind and uses his imagination to his power. And I'd rather do that. I personally would. Oh, no. Oh. I don't know, a lot more... Oh, so it's kind of shaky. It looks like people would rather be Calvin than Hobbes. And I can see why. I can see why. Let's see. Would you rather never understand the concept of time or never understand the concept of sex? Oh, God. This meaning you would not be able to tell time or anything related to time and never understand anything that has to involve sex. Sex. Please. I'd rather not know about it. I would personally take... I would under... What? Let's... People chose to side with me. Ah, oh, sorry about that, guys. Let's people would rather choose to side... Oh, God. Why would they never... Why would people not want to understand the concept of time? That doesn't make any sense. It really doesn't. Let's see. If you were hit by a car, would you rather... Room with no secure in sight, or die when it, right when the car hits you. Oh god, both of these are horrible. Okay, locked in syndrome, not able to speak or move, only able to blink even, only able to blink if even that. Oh god, that's horrible syndrome. I don't want to be stuck like that, but to die when the car hits you, that's horrible. I don't want to be suffering in syndrome. I would rather die on the spot. Sorry, guys. And I started with the right side this time. And I'm sorry if you guys didn't know that was a fart. Sorry. I kind of gassed it. Let's see. Would you rather be if any in fall or be able to pull out any Acme Corporation product out of your pocket? And it says you cannot use one ability to achieve the other, i.e. pulling out parachutes inside of a fall, skydive into me, Corv warehouse. Doesn't make sense. Ugh. All right, guys, something's kind of buggy about this channel. But anyways, just forget about that. Anyways, uh, personally, I would be. Able, I don't like to survive any injury or fall. Really, I prefer that because I don't. I would. I don't care. I don't think nice to. I don't know, whatever. Never mind. Let's see, would you rather be a male police officer with a high-pitched voice? Police officer with the appearance of an eight-year-old. Oh god, this is both horrible. You cannot lower your voice, you cannot and never you would never appear older. Your partner would be semi understanding of your situation. <laughs> semi understanding. Oh god. I I won't have to go with a fished voice. Oh wow. Yeah, but I don't have to talk. No, I don't have to talk. I can just write down on the piece of paper what I'm thinking or what I want to say. Oh, God. Oh, so I'm sorry. Um, I would rather be that. And I, I could also be able to use sign language. And my partner can learn how to use sign language. But have the appearance, uh, that won't do with me. But sorry, guys. Would you rather be the student who sleeps in class or be the student that always talks in class? Well, usually I went here and there in class, but I never really slept in class. Because if you sleep in class, you're going to be like the kid that misses out on a lot, and you'll get in trouble. And it's like, all right, do this question. It's like, oh, wait, what? And you're just, uh, what did I miss? And yeah, it's just, you get in trouble for that. But when the one that talks, I can live with. I can live with that one more than being the one who sleeps in class. And I went to the vast majority. Why aren't you in? Okay. Would you rather be a mall cop or a prison guard? Okay, if you were a prison guard, it would be pretty bad because I've seen the commercials for the for TV for documentaries of people being a prison being a rookie for the prison guard the first years, and it is horrible. Prison is a horrible place, and it is very disgusting. But mall cop, 
I'd rather be that because I would be able to be a ball, ball, ball walker, ball, walker, or whatever his name was. I'd rather be him and be someone who actually just goes around the mall on the, my little scooter, making sure everyone's following the rules. I don't want to be a prison guard because I would suck. That would really suck. It really would. Okay. Let's see. Would you rather sleep in the room a little warm or sleep in the room a little too cold? Well, it doesn't say what the temperature or what the room has to be. But it also doesn't say what you can use. To so, we, um, I don't even know one that's a little too cold. Because I have slept in the room that's been a little too cold before, and I am with the vast majority again. Oh, God. Sorry, guys. I have no idea why I'm being so gassy. Let's see. Would you rather fall two stories onto concrete or fall two stories into freezing water? Oh, God. That sucks. So, and says in the bomb, break your bones. Or frisk freezing to death. That sucks. And, uh. And, uh. Oh god, these are both horrible. Yeah, they're very horrible. I don't know which one to do. Um. Oh god, damn it. Sorry, guys, but the computer's not responding. Ah, there we go. Um. Yeah, I would rather. Fall two stories into. I would rather break. I'm not to say how hard. Uh, I would. Seriously? Wow. Oh. It doesn't say what certain parts of my bone. Oh. Let's see, which one? Oh, this is Star Wars. This is supposed to be Star Wars, okay. Let's see. Would you rather own a lightsaber or know the ways of the Force? But I will love both of these. I will love both of these, actually, but. I don't know if I should choose either owning a lightsaber or knowing how to use the force. Um, personally, I don't like to know how to use the force because I can be able to move stuff around. Owning a lightsaber would be very hard because you just pretty much kill anyone and can think about it both ways. But I don't like to know how to use the force. I don't like to know how to you levitate things and move them around and for you people it would be a lot easier because you would be more lazy. I would rather know the ways of the Force, and I was the vast majority this time, I guess. Let's see. Oh god, both of these are horrible. With your hand, bare hands. Or fight a large bear with a sword. Oh, okay. Wait. Oh, and it says you have a sword, not the bear. Yeah, that would suck if the bear had the sword. That means you die. Yeah, okay, let's see. Um, um I actually be able to fight a wolf with my hands. Why buy a bear? It just sucks. Yeah, I would rather fight a wolf because you can you know, let's see. If you want the time machine, would you rather it be a DeLorean or be a telephone booth? Oh my god. I think this is supposed to be reference to uh this is supposed to be reference to Back to the Future and Doctor Who. Because actually in Doctor Who it's not a phone booth, it's a London police call box. That's what it is. And a DeLorean was a normal vehicle used back in the 80s. And that's a vehicle used for the vehicle, for the time machine and Back to the Future. And I've seen it, and it's really cool. And personally, I love that, but that means inside the telephone, I mean, but inside the TARDIS, it's larger than it seems on the outside. It's just freaking huge, I don't know why. It's really interesting. I can't think about it, but a DeLorean would just be a normal car, and you have to go 88 miles per hour in order to travel to the future. Yeah, I rather, I rather have a DeLorean. I don't know about you guys, but a DeLorean. Let's see, here we go. Da da da. da. Twisty nips. Oh well, it is what it is, I guess. But I would rather have it be a DeLorean because I can actually use it to drive around the, around the place. But oh well, it is what it is. Would you, would you rather be a member of NSYNC or be a member of the village people? Both of these, I have no idea what this is, but 
and that's why C and C. Uh, I went the vast majority, although I had no idea who they were. <laughs> Let's see. Um, would you rather be able to fly up to meters off the ground, or have a magic carpet that can fly up to 50 meters off the ground? Eh, as much as I don't like to fly myself, it will be hard to control. But personally, if I had a magic carpet, I could control it and take me where I need to go. And it'd be a lot easier. I'd also be able to save on gas, come to think about it. Yeah, I could be able to save gas on that. I don't want, I want to deal with traffic. If you're five meters, you're, you can easily hit vehicles. And it's kind of dicey, almost about even shmeven. Let's see. Would you rather control the emotions of those around you? Control the witnesses. Oh. This isn't mind control, and you're not going to make them slaves. It's more of an influence. Oh, okay, so... Control the weather means that I'll be able to control what I could do, but control emotions of those around me would be nice also, but... Um... Actually, I don't like to control emotions. I'm sorry, guys, but I don't know. Just... I just feel like doing it, though, but it's kind of dicey, but... Almost even. Let's see. Would you rather play dodgeball or footwear? Oh, it says no spiking. Oh, that thing that goes for four square. I, I want to do four square than dodgeball because dodgeball, it doesn't. Actually, I couldn't think about it. It doesn't say how, what type of ball you use for dodgeball, but if it is like those really hard ones, no, I'm not doing it. But, um, actually. I can be able to do dodgeball. I can be able to live with that. Yeah, dodgeball. I was thinking about Foursquare, but eh. That game started to get old. Here we go. Um, would you rather attempt to survive a computer uprising, Terminator, or attempt to survive a zombie outbreak on the dead? Um. I don't know actually. Both of these are horrible. And zombies can be turning one of them Terminator or just die instantly, but Zombies And it is more to the zombies. Okay. Okay, that's nice. Okay. Would you rather make out with Gollum or with Beetlejuice from the movie? Oh god no, I'm not doing this. Would you rather be only reading romance novels or textbooks? I take textbooks. I can live with reading textbooks. I really can. It's kind of dicey. Okay. Oh god, yeah, I'd rather get smarter than come more rapid. Okay, would you rather be an Olympic tennis player or a table tennis player? Um. Hmm. No, uh, this is interesting. Um, let's see. Um, being an Olympic table tennis player, I'd rather do that. Uh, let's see. Uh, wow, rather people would rather be a tennis player. Okay, okay, I understand. All right. Let's see. Would you rather eat a tablespoon of salt or a tablespoon of cinnamon? I would rather with salt. I'm sorry, guys. At least this isn't going to kill me. With cinnamon, is really strong. That, from what I've heard. Oh, God. Okay, would you rather have to eat the same meal, every meal, for the rest of your life? Or eat whatever you want, except once a month you will have to eat a doo-doo sandwich? Oh, it says it's your doo-doo if that's any help. God. Every meal. I'm sorry, guys. Every meal. Save meal every day. Oh, God. That's kind of disgusting. If you only do one thing, would you rather sit or stand? Hmm. Nah, I'd rather stand. I don't know about you guys, but I'd rather stand. I like standing. Really sit? Why? Just why? Alright, let's see. If you could only choose one feature of accessory to own, would you rather have Google Glass or Apple Smart Watch? Personally, I don't care about any of those, but... Watch?
Sí, marica. People would rather take Google Glass. Okay, I understand. Would you rather be a graphic designer or an architect? A graphic designer is for, if you don't know what a graphic designer is, is graphic designers are people that do designing in video games. Ah, oh, crap. Sorry about that. Um, if you don't know, graphic designers are people that design video games and design graphics in the video games. And an architect is a person who's de who designs buildings and structures. So, do you like to, I like to be a graphic designer or not? Graphic designer. Let's see, and I'm with the vast majority. All right, that's nice. Let's see, if you have broken the law, would you rather spend five years in prison but return to your old life with no ill consequences, or never go to prison and move every year for the rest of your life? Um. I'd rather never go to prison and move. What? Oh. Would you rather have a knee thigh hair or one foot of mohawk? Oh god, um. Mohawk? Okay, people would rather have knee length there. Why? Would you rather always wear a top hat or wear a giant clock necklace? What? Let's say how. Uh, 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 but personally, I would rather wear a top hat than a giant clock necklace. That's that's what I feel. Alright, I can live with a... Alright, let's see, uh, oh... Let's see that. Oh, well, too late now. I was just reading the whole description below, if you guys didn't know. Let's see. Would you rather... Lose your thumb? Or lose the index and middle finger of your preferred hand? Mmm... -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'd rather lose my preferred thumb because I can live with that than losing two of my fingers. I personally would. All right, let's see what do we got. If you could kill Victor and Harry Potter, would you rather kill Voldemort or I know if uh, I think. Yeah, it's kind of going a little slow. Sorry about that, guys, but I'm just gonna see. Uh, oh. Yeah, Master Joey will agree with me to kill Voldemort. All right, that's nice. Oh God, that's a pretty big number. Whew. Let's see what we got next. Would you rather be captured by a wild tribe in the jungles, or be captured by at sea? Ooh, both of these are bad. I don't know. Be captured by pirates at sea. God damn, you did not know I did. Close my eyes, and just went back, back and forth. But I guess I'm with the with the mass majority. That's a good thing. Would you rather have natural childbirth or epidural? Oh god. I am not a female, if you guys are wondering. But if I were a female, I wouldn't want to have childbirth, natural childbirth, because, oh. Well, I don't know. I just don't want to get too complicated, guys. Oh, God. I did not need to... I don't know if I want to answer that one or not. I'm really sorry, guys. Let's see. If you have superpowers from an unknown origin, you are allow the government to experiment on you. You are not allowed the government to experiment on you. Blue consequence. One, imprisonment. Two, death consequence. One, never known the truth behind your powers. Two, being ostracized. Three, being hunted down. Oh god. God, it's supposed to be, oh god. These are horrible. I don't care. I don't want the government testing on me. I do not want that. I will never do that. I will never let, I will never let that happen to me. 
We'd rather have a child in seventh grade and raise it. Or never have kids or adopt. Any child you have can not pass the responsibility to anyone else. Mm. Oh, that's in seventh grade. I can live with adoption. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I can live with that. I can live with that. Oh, crap. That's if I was a female. Crap. I'm too late now, I guess. Would you have a bright blue hair? Or have bright blue teeth? Uh, I can have bright blue hair. I prefer that. And I'm with 89% of the people. That's nice. Here we go. What's next? Would you rather eat with wet your weight on in feet pit, pig feet or dive in the pool of horseradish and worms? Eat your weight you sit in the pool however long it will take to eat the fake pig. No dip and dashing. Oh god, these are horrible. Fuck. Sorry. I'm sorry. I sorry about the profanity. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, sorry, oh god, this is horrible. Eat pig feet, no. Why did I not go to the list of the crap? Sorry, sorry. Uh, sorry, it's acting like a freaking monkey right now. Oh god. Would you rather only be able to like, uh, laugh at blonde jokes or not be able to understand the sarcasm? I think I saw a Jacksepticeye do this one. He chose laugh at blonde jokes and... Uh, and not understand sarcasm. Because if you never understood sarcasm, you look like a freaking idiot. I'm serious. You will look pretty stupid. Oh, no. Would you rather save Abraham Lincoln or John F. Kennedy? Ah, uh, Kennedy. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, God. Oh, more people chose to save Abraham Lincoln than Kennedy? Wow. And, uh, blown up. Oh. Well, it's actually kind of close, though. Sorry, this is going slow for you guys. God. I'm just gonna do a couple more, then I'll call it done. Alright, a couple more until this is done, alright? Just a few more, and I'll call this quits. Would you rather have the ability to teleport or be able to time travel? And you cannot be able to affect, and you will not be able to affect this time space continuum. Okay, that's a good thing. Um, teleportation because I'll be able to teleport from one spot to another spot, which would be cool. Time travel will also be cool, but you could also screw up history or die in history, which would suck. But teleportation, I guess. And wow, this was fairly close, actually, uh, just by a few thousand. Wow, this is actually freaking even, even schmeven. <laughs> wow. Would you rather have constantly have 40 pounds of weight on your shoulders or constantly have 10 pounds on each of your feet? Of uh, feet. Sorry, guys. Fe oh, okay, so I'm with the vast majority. I have 40 pounds on my shoulders would be a lot. And I don't think I could do much, but 10 pounds of weight on my feet, I can live with. Would you rather fight Apollo Creed or Ivan Ivan Drago? This is for Apollo Creed and Ivan Drago are two well-known antagonists in the Rocky film series. Apollo Creed. Yeah, Apollo Creed. I prefer Apollo Creed. I've never seen the movies, but I know who these guys are. Alright, just one more, and I'll call this done. Would you rather visit Hogwarts from Hogwarts is from uh Harry or visit Narnia from the Narnia series. In the Chronicles of Narnia series. Um well those would be cool. In Hogwarts I can be able to learn how to use magic and do this stuff. But if I also visit Narnia, um I can be able to go to this place that has like a medieval setting, which which will be cool. Which I I personally think would be but, oh, excuse me. Oh, come on. As I was saying, um, 
Narnia is more of a medieval setting, and you could go there if you please to. And but just to visit Narnia is a weird way. Like you go through these objects to get there, and there's a lot. There's even talking animals there. I personally would prefer to go to Narnia and visit Hogwarts. Oh, I can see why. Well, it up on the bad side. Well, that's about it. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to look this up, check look it up on either and enter it and you'll be able to find this here. Uh, this is interesting though. I enjoy doing this. Um, I plan on doing more of this in the future actually. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this. If you like this video, get that like button and go to us, slap at the face like your mom. And until next time, this is Rabbit's Master signing off. Bye guys.